Hey guys, welcome back to Squid and Pig Guitars. My name is Ben, and today we're going to be looking at another awesome guitar in uh, an episode of Those We Love. Today, this one's a cool blue Ernie Ball Music Man um, Axis, so let's go and check it out in the storeroom and go over the specs. So guys, let's go and check out this guitar. So, as we were saying in the intro, this is a Music Man. This is the cool first edition Axis model. So, if you guys don't know, this was initially released in 1995 under the name Axis, but this was uh, co-designed with Eddie Van Halen as his original signature. But when he left for uh, PV, they changed it to the Axis model. But as you can see, it's kind of that kind of Frankenstein designs are still in there. Some in, in some ways, you've got the Floyd Rose. Obviously, you've got like the uh, the bridge pickup, but they've added a neck as well. Um, but yeah, just to confirm, this isn't an Eddie Van Halen signature, but he did design it originally. So the specs of this guitar, I'll put it back down for this. We basically have a basswood body, and we have a book matched flame maple top, finishing this beautiful blue finish. Alongside that, we have an awesome uh, maple neck, and on these, it kind of varies. But sometimes you get a bit of bird's eye in there, a little bit of flame. It's kind of mismatched, but it's really nice. Um, as you can see, a double looking tremolo with the Floyd Rose. A nice addition on this one is you have a matched headstock veneer, which is also blue, and mother of pearl tuners, which I think is a really nice touch. See there? Really, really stylish. This is great for any hard rock players. I mean, um, Steve Stevens and uh, obviously if you have Eddie Van Halen have been known to uh, play these guitars. So they're really suited to that rock style, um, and it's very simple, one volume, and a pickup selector. And the weight on this one, uh, you're talking about it's about seven pounds, quite a light guitar, but obviously it's quite small as well. So yeah, and this one's in really, really good condition. I was told that apparently the guy who owned this has owned it for 15 years, or owned it before us has owned it for 15 years and it was under his bed the whole time, so it's pretty much in mint condition. And also just with the electronics, um, in terms of pickups, we just have like, they're not the hottest pickups in the world, but they're kind of like medium output. And I think that's intentional because uh, like the initial uh, original pickup in the Frankenstrap was like a, a PAF, like a Gibson one. So you can still get hard rock tones, but it's more kind of classic rock, I would say. So this is the kind of first Axis model, which was released in 1995. You also find there's an Axis Sport model that came in 1997, which had a few more additions and then a hollow one. So this is the original. So I, I, don't, I can't remember what year this is, but... Hopefully it's 1995. So I'd say the neck profile is quite similar to like a Charvel um, San Dimas model or something like that. Quite round, um, a little wider than your usual strap. And uh, yeah, if you see here, nice small fretboard inlays. But yeah, as we said, extremely good condition. So if you want a case queen of a absolute iconic model, check this out. So guys, that brings us to the end of another video, uh, another episode of Those We Love. Um, as you can see, this is a really, really cool guitar, and um, I hope we've kind of done it justice in today's video. If you are interested in this guitar or have any other questions, make sure to leave them down in the comments below or send us an email. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.